back to week six of my 10 week rhetorical series. I'm Justin Brew. Let me ask you a question. What's the best place to hold a controversial conversation? Is it the church? How about in your house? Maybe at a local community group? Or what about the local coffee house, Starbucks? Starbucks has been placing on their cups, either handwritten or with stickers, race together. Not a running race, but a skin color race or ethnicity. Race together. And they've been doing this in order to bring up topic and discussion regarding uh, some of the racial issues that are going on in society. And however, it's a good idea. They've been getting roasted for it. And people have been saying Starbucks does not have the authority or the position in any way, shape, or form to be trying to educate or facilitate discussion regarding race. But there's people that completely disagree. For example, Attorney General Eric Holder. In 2009, he called the U.S. a nation of cowards. Now granted, that's a while ago, but the principle still stands today. He called them a nation of cowards because the American culture is completely void of allowing people to have deep and beneficial conversations. Personally, I think it's a great idea. There's thousands of patrons that come in every day. I mean, in 2014, Starbucks made $10.75 billion. And, I mean, there's thousands of patrons that come in, buy their coffee every day, and get to have great discussion regarding race and ethnic. I mean, 40% of their 200,000 employees are minorities. So why not? I mean, you have a great minority basis. So why not talk about race and some of the other issues uh, that are at hand within our nation?